I, I'm going to read for you today A Squash and a Squeeze. Okay, it's by Julie, Julia Donaldson and Axel Scheffler. It's the same people who, who wrote and brought the Gruffalo. The Gruffalo. Okay? So by the creators of the Gruffalo, which is also a great book. Okay? Um, and the Snail and the Whale, too. Okay? So please, if you have this book, you can read it with me. Okay? So. Um, um, it starts with these wonderful pictures. Why does this book have cows and goats and pigs and chickens and a hen? Okay, so here we go. Oh, I'll go like this. A little old lady lived all by herself with a table and chairs and a jug on the shelf. Hmm. Here's the jug, a water jug on the shelf. Good. A wise old man heard her grumble and grouse. There's not enough room in my house. Wise old man, won't you help me, please? My house is a squash and a squeeze. Okay? So she's saying her house is too small. There's not enough stuff. There's not enough space in her house. Okay? Take in your hen, said the wise old man. Take in my hen? What a curious plan. Mm. Well, the hen laid an egg on the fireside rug and flapped around, around the room, knocking over the jug. Hmm, this is a problem. The jug is broken. Bah! Ah, what happened here? The little old lady cried, what shall I do? It was pokey for one, and it's tiny for two. My nose has a tickle, and there's no room to sneeze. My house is a squash and a squeeze. And she said, wise old man, won't you help me please? My house is a squash and a squeeze. Hmm. So, I think the hen should go out, right? <gasps> Take in your goat, said the wise old man. Hmm. Take in my goat, what a curious plan. <clears throat> well, the goat chewed the curtains and trod on the egg then sat down to nibble the table leg. Mm, I don't know if this is helping. The little old lady cried, glory be! It was tiny for two and it's titchy for three. The hen pecks the goat and the goat's got fleas. My house is a squash and a squeeze. And she said, wise old man, won't you help me please? My house is a squash. And a squeeze. <laughs> this goat has fleas. So, goat, hen, outside fleas, yes? So, the wise old man, definitely, definitely, why not? Send them out. Huh? <gasps> mm. The little old lady cried, oh, what happened here? Aye, that happens when you don't flip the pages properly. Something was wrong. Take in your pig, said the wise old man. Take in my pig. What a curious plan. It's a big pig. So she took in her pig, and who kept chasing the hen, and raiding the larder again and again. So he's going to the larder and taking all the food. <laughs> I love this goat on the bed. Pig, what are you doing? <laughs> okay, here's the picture we've already seen. Oh, oh, the old lady. The little old lady cried, stop, I implore. It was titchy for three and it's teeny for four. Even the pig in the larder agrees. My house is a squash and a squeeze. And she said, wise old man, won't you help me please? My house is a squash and a squeeze. Those three animals look happy. <laughs> Rubbing their stomachs. Oh. Get rid of the animals. Definitely, right? Ay, uh, Taking your cows at the wise old man. Oh. Taking my cow. What a curious plan. She's hitting him with a switch. Well, the cow took one look and charged straight at the pig, then jumped on the table and tapped out a jig, a dance. 
This is not the right house for this. Ah! The little old lady, the little old lady cried, "Heaven's alive! It was teeny for four, and it's weeny for five. I'm tearing my hair out, and I'm down on my knees. My house is a squash and a squeeze." And she said, "Wise old man, won't you help me, please? My house is a squash and a squeeze." Ooh. Take them all out said the wise old man, but then I'll be back when I first began. Yeah, back to the same house. So she opened the window and out flew the hen. That's better, at least I can sneeze again. She shooed out the goat and she shoved out the pig. My house is beginning to feel pretty big. She huffed and she puffed and she pushed out the cow. Just look at my house. It's enormous now. I like the cow with all the flies. <laughs> Thank you, old man, for the work you have done. It was weenie for five. It's gigantic for one. There's no need to grumble and there's no need to grouse. There's plenty of room in my house. Okay. So she started in the same place but her feelings are different. Her feelings are very, very different, okay? So she changed her thinking. So the wise old man did help her, okay? The wise old man helped her to, to, to think differently about her house. Maybe you can do the same. Bye-bye.